Hey, Pat, it's Midnight Designer, and we are back playing Seven Day. Today. And we're back in the Dijon Muster Challenge, and it is day two, but <laughs> because, hold on, I'm going to pause. Because my life is crazy, uh, we had an issue. The, the, the world, the game save that I was playing on uh, got corrupted. So I had to start over again. I spent, that's why today's video is late, because uh, I spent all of my time yesterday when I would have been recording trying to recover the world, either from a backup or whatever else, and I could not. So I have had to start over again but instead of taking the glorious opportunity to show yet another day one romp through the first three floors of the dijon tower um i decided to just go ahead and do it i'll show you real quick uh, what we have here we have a little bit of food and uh, importantly we have a corn we have a blueberry and um I guess that's all that's important. I wish we could turn these into seeds and make eggplants. Whoa, oh, that'd be funny. Or whatever, the other thing. Uh, and here are our uh, weapons and tools. Here is our miscellaneous stuff. Here is our other miscellaneous stuff. Now, the only other thing that I got done after I did the whole... Uh, uh, get things sorted out and organized and everything was I yunked on a bunch of potted plants until I got two seeds. I planted trees on the roof of the entrance where the soldiers spawn. How long does this thing take to, there it is. Uh, so we'll have, we got a couple of trees going. Um, it would be cool to get farming going as soon as possible. Uh, I put, uh, let's see, I put a point into Lucky Looter. I'm going to try that. Uh, so that is where that is. Uh, I put a point into Skull Crusher so we can get the level 2 sledge. I put a point into Sexy T-Rex. I would love to find a cigar so we could maybe put another point into Sexy T-Rex without having to put points into Strength. Uh, let's see here. I put a point into Healing Factor and Iron Gut and i don't think i put any points in here and an intellect i haven't put any points so that's where we are right now but uh we are now on the floor of the business man and we are going to engage the business man in glorious business and after we kill them all then we will go around and loot okay i would like for you all to wake up maybe one at a time would have been cool but it is whatever i just don't want to get flanked i was about to i was about to flunk flank let's take care of these guys and so what we'll do is we'll run the floor we will uh kill the zombies pick up anything we can pick up and then we will come back and loot uh, I think that is uh, a, a, a smart way to do it. I did find some looting goggles, so that, that'll give us another bump in the lootage, which is cool. But he flipped for me. <laughs> uh, so we'll clear this corner over here. Thanks. Hello, zombie and other zombie and other other zombie. Now, I think that the walls on this floor, the interior walls, are made of wood. So we should be able to create ourselves a, uh, a fairly decent pathway around the, uh, around the floor without having to do a whole lot of the dungeon crawly stuff. So let's pop this. Let's grab you. I've looted this room, so we don't have to go in there. That was part, I looted that as part of the entrance into the area. But yeah, we can plow through these pretty quick and uh, get uh, to the zombies. 
and kill them <clears throat> without having to like circle back in a whatever very difficult circular path this is always gone this block is always missing i wonder if it's missing on porpoise or if it's missing because there's some kind of structural whatever with the building and it always collapses but i feel like it would leave a debris pile so i almost feel like it would have to be um it would have to be like there's a hole just in the building which is weird right i mean it's a building it should be built without holes so this guy he's yoinked and we're yoinking things and we're moving people and we're walking we're not running and i've been hearing the nonsense of tomfoolery outside so or not either outside or downstairs man we got a skill point yay i interrupted his swing animation permanently dang it i was hoping to close that door before the third one came out but i have a feeling it's not gonna matter that much okay so we yoinked everything in there let's do some yoinking I shouldn't yoink on my channel, right? Because that's not family friendly. But I must yoink. I'm a yoinker. I'm a yoinker from Yonkers. Actually, I lived in the Bronx, but not Yonkers. All right, you two. Get down to business. That is what you get for not using the TPS cover sheet. Do people still watch that movie? The movie's like super old. Office Space, you should see it if you have not. Later, watch the video first. My retention rate's bad enough. You don't need to go watching movies in the middle of the episode, even though, you know, it's a pretty good movie. You should totally go check it out. All right, you don't even get up. All right, you're all the way dead. And what about your friends? He got he got whomped with some authority. And that's all sorted. And we're back. Look at that. Cleared it like an actual boss. So let's drop off. You go here. You go here. You go here. I'm not gonna do that every time. Okay. So we are chock full of inventory space and yoinking on the goggles. And let's go steal the treasures. I'm interested to see if putting a point in Lucky Looter is appreciably different at all. did pretty well for ourselves this is the big one we got our cigars so we added one to strength so that is very cool um very cool indeed i'm gonna switch these out because otherwise i will forget uh let's see we got the heist time charges eh. we learned how to make a handgun which is eh. 
Now the rest of this stuff, let's see, are you, you're actually better than the boots I'm wearing. So let's actually, let's clear out all the dyes first. Um, there's really no, no need to keep these extra clothes. So let's scrap the dies for paint and you are better. So I'll wear you. So you're wait, I don't understand. Uh, wait, no, hold on. Time out, time out here. What am I wearing? Who am I wearing? So I'm wearing the cowboy boots. They're four three and these are four three. It doesn't show like a compare thing for those. Um, okay, but this one's better for heat resist and not as good for cold resist. I don't think that weather survival is a factor. So all I care about is the run speed and I've already got that. Um, let's see, do I have a fortitude? You are perception. So you get got and I think everything else I just scrapped for now so your fortitude your perception they're all the same so we'll scrap everything else and then put everything away and then we will have to get ready because the main event is going to be taking on the construction floor. So let me put all this stuff away and we'll get ready to take on the hard hats. All right. So this is my least favorite floor in the game, even though upper floors have, um, probably tougher enemies. This one, for whatever reason, is just the bane of my existence. Let's see. I can't place a block in there. Should we fall back to here or just... Just take them. Just take them. Okay, I love that you got confused. Okay, I ate a little bit and drank a little bit before I came up here, so we're pretty good on that stuff. So the next the next corner here is filled with collapsing floor. And I always get got. <laughs> because they changed the layout somewhat. Okay, you're gonna fall down like I am, but I didn't get hurt. See, I always, even though I literally know that it's all terrible all the time up there, I still get got every time. I don't know why, because I can't mesmerize the pattern, I suppose. Uh, let's see, let's repair you. Okay. And just so we know what we're dealing with now, these, there should be two here, right? Okay. So this should all be safe. So let's get rid of this frame and then make ourselves a little walkies way there. Okay. Now when I'm, I'm having my, oh my goodness moment, I will not in fact fall down into the hole, but, uh, I mean, possibly I will not obviously possibly I will. Okay. So let's load up and start with you that was a warning shot he did not flee the area and you 
and you and you flee the area or die okay so for our next trick we gotta go into here and there's bad guys did I mention did I mention let me finish there's bad guys whoa I feel like that block went down a lot faster than I was expecting those hard hat guys hit like tanks for the memories and uh, the memories were not good collect this stuff to stuff into containers when we do our return trip how are we doing we're looking good tight clean and lovely just like I don't know something inappropriate there's a that guy okay so we got to clear this room. I think that this guy will get triggered as soon as we walk in, which is fine. Oh, and his friend and his other and his three other friends. Okay. Uh, okay. You all are coming this way. We are going to fight. Are you all coming? Okay. They got corn fused and separated. From. Okay, so This doesn't work if you don't attack in the area I want you to Here does it help if I move the door out of the way? Whoa! Okay. It's a sneak attack! Now I'm fairly certain they'll come through here. Now are the blocks overkill? I don't know. Am I gonna have to deal with them again? I don't know, but we got a skill point and didn't die, so I'm feeling like that was okay decision-wise. But yeah, this, especially when they did the drop down, turn around, shake it all about, uh, surprise attack, that was, uh, that threw the whole plan into corn fusion. Now, I think we cleared that whole room. Okay, I was kidding. I was kidding. Okay. <laughs> All right, well best laid plans and whatnot how many arrows do i have 37 that may not get us through this next part that may not get us through this next part really i just ate well you spent all that energy hammer and stuff another one somewhere and somebody wasted all his frames somebody 
All right, this room is now clear. And now we do the trench run, which is awful. Because the, the tough part about the trench run is that you cannot recover your arrows, even if they would be otherwise recoverable. So that's sad. There's this guy. There's this guy. Frick! And he's just leaving. I don't care so much about the blue shirt guys. It's more the... What was that? Uh-oh. Somebody's doing something somewhere. That's bad. I mean, the good news is that they can't really path up here. So whatever they're doing to the building is uh, not going to impact us. Unless, of course, they collapse the building. And uh, so that would be bad. Okay, so this is where the Sky Mall closes. Where is that other zombie doing damage? Probably somewhere. And let's just check. Is there a zombie here? Nope. All right, so we are down and down and down. On the other side of that, that's where is zombies. That's where is zombies. So hopefully we can recover some arrows from some of the fallen. That would be cool. There's one, you know, not a huge return. Wait, I hate that those garbage things make noise. It makes me want to destroy them. Where were you? Where were you, good sir? I don't recall. I don't recall. Okay. Whoa! Holy crap on a cracker. Holy crap on a cracker! Okay, now there's guys up there. And I know you're like midnight, uh, you keep doing this trick and it doesn't work for you. You know what? Let me do me. Cause they hit hard. See, look, look at that door. That door didn't do nothing to nobody. I am sort of glad that they occasionally just sort of fall down. And another one. And another, another one. Yeah. This is, uh, this is the ideal situation as far as I'm concerned. This is ideal. Just get up. Gotta get up to go down. All right. Is everybody? Yeah, there's more guys. So on the off chance, 
on the off, 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 crazy, I know it sounds, chance we have to beat a hasty retreat to the street or the other side of that wall. Let's have a way to do that, that we can yoink up and the zombies cannot follow. Well, hello there. These guys are tanky as. These guys are tanky as. Okay. You are the precious. There should be a one room and then a hallway and then we're clear. Laying around on the job. All right, there should be one more zombie in this elevator, and then we're clear. You're dead. All right. We did a thing. So let's loot. We missed a floor. Or a room. That's why I always, I always go back. There's usually someone, ooh, pumpkin seed that I missed. All right, back to looting. All right, we're back. And let's see. I mean, that is not a floor where you're going to get a lot of, of um, food, but you can get some decent other stuff. Now, I'm fairly certain this won't go, the barb thing won't go on the, th that's only a club item. So we'll hold on to that. Um, we also got some Mo Beta gear. Is this? Yeah. So we're getting pretty kitted out as far as the gear goes. Our mobility is, wow, way down. So that's, that is a certain amount of sadness, but, uh, the protection, I don't know. Is it better to be in a tank or, uh, not tank? We got a pumpkin seed, which is cool. We got another blueberry seed to add to our blueberry collection. Um, the other thing we got, which was not necessarily a loot item, uh, we got the, uh, air con I'm like off center. We got the air conditioner, which uh, will give us an engine. So that is pretty great. We've got these, which is not worth us keeping, but that is a pretty good shovel and it's more better than our shovel. So unfortunately, that is all the time I have for this episode. 
And so what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to spend the rest of the evening just like gathering supplies, especially up on the construction floor, getting some of those materials. Um, I think that will do well for us. <coughs> and we got an anvil, which is cool. So in our next episode, we are taking on the fitness floor, which should be my area of expertise because I am fit. I am fitting to be fit and uh, our, we are all going to go up there and join the gym and pay dues and probably never use it and they're gonna that's how they make their money but whatever it's fine but we did it we survived another set of floors so I hope you had fun if you like this video please hit the like button if you want to see more subscribe if you want to start a conversation, why do you not start one? Where? In the comment section below, another Dijon Tower challenge is in the books. Thanks for watching and have a great day.